Hi there, we've got a pole here for oil change. Um, so, 19 mil sump plug. So we'll just drop the oil, let that drain in and get the filter. So 19, usually for tight, you get a whack, it comes off. Like that. It's just a chop plastic tub I'm using it today, but. So we'll just let that drip away. So that's been dripping away for a while. Yeah. New, new washer on the sump plug. So we'll just put that back in. Tighten up and then remove the filter. Uh, just to be nip up. Oh, I need to get my right. That's it. You can find the top signs if you want, but we nip up is fine. Some break cleaner. Oh, that's a bit good. So I've put some fresh oil on the seal, just to help it seal up. So fresh oil. Up, hand tight. That's all it's need. Clean all your mess up. That's looking good to me. <coughs> so now we've just got the car down so it's flat. And then so now we're going to top up the oil. That's where it was in. The cap. So there's a dipstick. So we're going to top up now. I can't seem to get on the internet to find out how much it takes. So we'll fire three litres in and then just check it and top up till it reaches the maximum.
So on that side, we've got the three liters in there. So put the cap on, start it up. It's gonna be saying. So now we'll just top up as we go along. So that's us there, just topped up until we get to the line. Can see it. Maximum, minimum. So we're banging on the max. So that's us. Cap on. And then we need to reset the light on the dash. I've done a video already on that, but I might as well do it now while I'm here. Alright, so we're just going to turn the service light off now. So, hold the button on, on the left, ignition on, reset oil, reset, ignition off, so, hold the button, ignition on. that off obviously got our front parking issue i'll probably in another video thanks now so this is all good to go um, i've had it running i've got now checked to see if there's any leaks all good so that's us okay thanks out